the best box brownies you've ever made, Halloween edition. Start by sifting your box mix because you never know what kind of lumps will be inside these things. As you can see, I took some absolute rocks out of mine. Then we're going to mostly follow the box directions, but instead of adding water, we're going to use milk. And add your recommended amount of eggs, or get spooky like me and add the eggshells that you have to dig out. Then stir until you realize that you've forgotten an ingredient. Yep, that's about right. And instead of using the recommended amount of oil, swap it for butter. Mix your batter until it comes together. Grease a baking dish and line it with a strip of parchment paper before pouring in your batter and evening it out. Bake your brownies in the oven according to the package. The next secret to pulling those brownies perfectly out of the pan is to let them cool for at least 30 minutes. Now cut those suckers into squares and try not to drool over how moist and rich they look. And here comes the fun part. Take a large marshmallow and with your pointer fingers and thumbs, repeatedly pull the marshmallow apart and put it back together until you get a smooth goo consistency. Something like this. Then spread your fingers over the brownie and lay your marshmallow strands on it in all different directions. Finish them up with some candy eyes and enjoy. Thanks for watching. The full recipe and tips will be linked in the description box and I will see you guys next week.